Morning guys, it's Wiley here with the lovely Anna and this morning you join us for an unbagging and an unboxing. So the first thing is from Shirt Punch. Um, they did a deal. Um, the new Spider-Man film comes out this year and they were doing the deal. Um, I think the t-shirt was I think it was like ten dollars or something stupid. So I thought, well, I like Spider-Man, and it was a pretty badass T-shirt. So I thought, what the hell? Why not? And there it is. It's such a cool. It's a cool design. I gotta say, Shirt Punch did off do some really good designs. That's a really cool t shirt. I really like that t shirt. Really like that t shirt. That's a really cool one. So, another one to add to the collection. <clears throat> um, actually, it didn't cost that much, actually. It, did, it only cost me um, my shipping, actually, because I had a £10 gift voucher. So, it only cost me shipping. So. That's why I got it. And the nerd block is, they would like I said they were doing a deal over Christmas. Um, no, Black Friday, sorry. And you could get a block for half price and then you get a grab block as well. Well, I had the sci-fi grab block. This is the nerd block. Um, I've got, I had the comic block as well. That, so that with that I'll get the horror block which is sh been shipped but it'll mostly get here a couple of maybe next week sometime um, they're not themed I think it's just basically geeky stuff with classic I haven't had a classic one for a while so this is my first one for a while so we'll do, go in, do it blind as normal and the first thing we got coasters can't have too many coasters <clears throat> we got Star Wars Rogue One coasters. I'm gonna break them out and have a look. Um, if you haven't seen Rogue One yet and you're a big Star Wars fan, you need to go and see it. It's very, very good. So we've got original Stormtrooper. Original Stormtrooper. Got Darth Vader, which is pretty cool. We've got a Tie Fighter, Tie Fighter pilot, and the last one we've got is the Death Star, which is pretty cool. So yeah, that's pretty cool. That is, uh, I like that. I like them. They're quite cool. Um, yeah, so yeah, if you haven't seen Rogue One, go and see it. It's uh, it's very good. Next one, next one, please, darling. Oh, okay. Nerdblock exclusive. We have a coin bank for Rogue One. It looks like it's a Star Wars theme. So we got a Rogue One coin bank. Look at this. Like I said, it's Nerdblock exclusive. I thought, it was a, I thought it was a mug then, I was going to start moaning and groaning because I, I have too many bloody mugs. Let's have a look at this. Well, that's really cool. I really like that. It's the new Death... Um, What are they called? The Death Trooper. <clears throat> That's a really cool piece. I like that. It's it feels like it's like porcelain or but that's really cool. I mean and as you can see you got the money thing on the back and I don't think I'm gonna use that as a money box but I'll put that on my Star Wars wall. 
Yeah. That's Star Wars War. I'll see if I can fit it up there somewhere, but that's pretty cool. I like that. That's a cool item. That's a really different item. Normally they put bloody mugs in which pisses everybody off. That's a pretty cool item. Different. Next please my darling. Oh, oh we got a lanyard. That'd be cool actually, it could come in handy for my pins. I could put my pins on it. So we got a keyring, a death trooper again. And we got the actual lanyard, so that's pretty pretty cool. And the lanyard itself, and then we got the what you call it? It's an official Rogue One, the Galactic Empire. Like I said, it, it looks like it's a dark side uh, box, which is pretty cool. Um, next item, please, darling. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I spoke too bloody soon. Look what we got. Darth Vader mug. Suppose we'll have a look at it. <clears throat> okay, that's supposed to be Darth Vader. Oh, it's Chrome, yeah. Actually, I've saw this. I've seen this mug. Um, a friend of mine, Joe Warlock, does unboxings and that, and I'm pretty sure he got this in his Star Wars box. I'll have to have a check. I mean, it's a pretty. I mean, it's a pretty cool. It's a pretty cool looking mug, actually, to be honest. That's a pretty cool mug. I quite like that mug actually. It's a mug, yes, but I like I quite like that mug. It's different. It's not your normal bog standard mug. And yeah, I'd be able to drink out of that. But yeah, I, I quite like that. Even though it's a mug, I quite like that mug. It's uh it's a different mug, it's not your normal you know. If it had been a normal mug, I'd have been really pissed off, but I can handle a Darth Vader mug. How many more items? Just t shirt. Mm -hmm. Four items and t shirt. Okay, and this one is the t shirt. Five. Five items. Five items. Okay. This is supposed to be, well, Everything has been Star Wars, Rogue One, Dark Side, Death, everything like that. But the T-shirt, for some unknown reason, I have no idea why. But it looks like it's a Dark Side anyway. It's a, it's a Decepticon T-shirt. So that's pretty badass. That's pretty cool, actually. Yeah, that's quite good. That's actually a lot. Of <coughs> Again, it's a shirt punch. I think it's a shirt punch, is it? Um, no, no, no. Oh, it's a Nerd Black exclusive. Cool. Apparently, they're all Nerd Black exclusive. Yeah, they're all Nerd Black exclusive. And the last item. That's it. That's it. They have the spoiler card and the thing bits and pieces. <laughs> so, the spoiler card, the, the main thing they said was the Rogue One story. So, what story? Death Trooper Coin Bank. And then we got the T-shirt, Decepticons, Transform and Rise Up, Show Your Allegiance to Megatron and Decepticons with this awesome T-shirt, Rogue One Lanyard and Keychain, the Darth, Darth Vader mug, which is only available at Nerdblock, and the Rogue One Star Wars coaster set. So, yeah. What's that? 
Oh yeah, they're doing, yeah, they're doing. I'm thinking about getting one of these. Um, while I wait for the other one. Um, they're doing new, they're updating their arcade block. It's not going to be called arcade block anymore. It's going to be called gamer block. Um, and there's two different, there are two different ones. You've got gamer block E, which is rated for everyone, but then there's a gamer block M, which is rated for Michelle. Now I was thinking about getting just getting one of the rated M one and just having a look see what it was like. Um, when I get paid, I might order it and just to see what it's like. So that's that. If you're a gamer, might be worth looking into it. The nerd block's not too bad, price-wise, to be honest. I think it works out to be about 30, 30 quid with postage, so it's not too bad. Oh, and the cool thing about it as well, which I read, is it comes with a game, a free game every month. Steam game, which is pretty cool. So that's cool. So in January's block, which I'm not getting, with it's Stark Industries, the theme. So they have, they have, they've started doing themes, basically. It looks like they've started doing themes. Um, which they never used to. They used to just be random. But yeah, the, the, the theme for Classic is Stark Industries. I'm not getting it, so I'm not really bothered. And that was that. So yeah, um, I'm quite impressed with it, actually. Uh, T-shirt really like. Mug's pretty cool, even though it's a mug. I like the coin thing. The lanyard and the... Things, uh, what you call it is cool. So yeah, um, what do you think? What do you think is your favourite item? T-shirt's cool, aren't it? And the, and the mug, even though it's a mug, it's a pretty cool mug. See, what I could do is I could give this as a pro uh, present. So yeah, um, I'm really hoping that um, my fried crate is in the country for last month. So I'm really, really looking forward to it. Hopefully it'll be here tomorrow. Um, I really can't wait for uh, Fry Crate. I really can't. Um, I'm trying to sort of keep off uh, YouTube because I don't want to spoil it. I really don't want anybody spoiling it for me. Um, I know that there's all I know. Uh, there's a figure in there. There's a leprechaun item. Um, Lita Fairy is doing something in there. Um, oh, and there's a pin as well, which is cool. January's. Um, which I've ordered. Um, I left the link in my last video. Um, if you want one, it works out to be $52, which is not too bad. That's shipped as well, which is really cool. Um, and the Bob boxes are quite big. Um, this month's is Puppet Master, Hostel, Lost Boys, and Trick or treat, so I'm looking forward to that. All things I absolutely love. So yeah, so um, thanks for watching. Um, if you liked the video, hit the like button. If you didn't like it, hit the dislike button. That's fine. Um, drop me a comment below. I like to read the comments. I, I'll always message, but I'll always comment back. Um, and if you haven't already subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Also, um, I'll be leaving the subscribe. It'll be around about. No, uh, let me work this out. It's going to be right either that corner or that corner over there. So, yeah, about, so it's either going to be there or there. I figured out how to do it. There you go, me. Um, so, you just click on that and it'll, so you can you'll subscribe. Um, make sure you hit the little alarm bell. That will basically tell you when I've updated a new, uh, uploaded a new video, so you have to keep in, keep keep an eye on what I'm doing. Um, I'm going to be doing a gameplay video when Anna goes to work, which will be going to work in a bit. There's a new game that's come out on for PlayStation Plus. Um, it's called This War of Mine: The Little Ones. Um, I had a quick go last night. Um, really enjoyed it. So I'm going to play that. I'm going to stream that live. Through my PlayStation 4 um, in a bit. Um, let me know what you think of it. Um, looks a really, really good game, but I'll, I'll talk more about the game when I'm playing it. 
so yeah so i'm gonna go um i'll catch you all in the next video love you lots bye for now bye